What's going on guys and welcome back to The Last of Us. We are now on part 9 of the series and we've just stumbled across Jesse after all that combat. We've just come across the dogs which I felt sick for doing but it had to be done and I wish it never happened. Um, but uh, yeah, we're moving on to part number 10 now and we've just gone into a flashback where we've just come across Tommy. So without further ado, we are two years earlier. Um, so this is a year after the last it's flashback. Birthday, if she didn't remind me when it was. You should just apologize to her. And remember, if you're enjoying the videos, like, subscribe, and also leave a bloody comment. Okay. What's going on? Nothing. Why? I can tell when you're off. Oh, Tommy knows. She's got some stuff on my mind. You let me know if you want to talk about it. Okay. She's growing up a little bit. Got stragglers. How many? Just a handful. Kind of stragglers. Oh, the zombie. Jeez. You want to give it a whirl? Hell yeah. Are you sure? I think well, Tommy's going to be the one that's going to be... <laughs> You know, pushing him more to be a bit more edgy. Because I don't think Joel will let her, you know. See that sign there? Red one? Try hitting that. Good way to draw him out of wherever they hide. Got aim higher. Leave the Wh bullet room to drop. Wait, there was drop? Make sure to compensate for the bullet drop. Get that road. There we go. There you go. Uh oh. Sounds attracting them. Well, we are on patrol. Let's clear them out. Oh god, go. it's semi-automatic. Shit. Gotcha. I, I was expecting it to reload, then I pull bolt. It's all of them. Nice. Usually more over this way if you want to keep shooting. Okay. Where are they coming from? Hordes like to move through this area in winter. They always end up leaving behind a few stragglers. They do the same routes every year? Like a migration or something. Hmm. What's that about? Well, when the barometric pressure reaches a certain temperature... St shit, I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> Check out the shed. Looks like they're moving downhill. Why? Hmm. Coming towards us. Uh, dead animal. Look up by the truck there. They're munching on that deer there. Guess they're hungry. Did they come out? You're natural. What you think? The bullet drop is a little crazy, to be honest. Two still. You're really getting it. Yes. I'm impressed. Looks clear. Bet there's some this way. The thing is, though, would you class this as wasting rounds? Like, they are cleaning the area up, but then if they don't there's remove them, the it could cause a big Look horde, right? There, under those gondolas. By that tower. You see it? Oh god, that's far. Oh! You're really getting it. Yes. Two in Very one. Left. Well done. Couple more. Huh? Gonna have to tell Joel about this. Well, I'm not seeing any more. Yeah, me neither. All right. Let's head in. See Let's head in. Sure. And her over. Oh. Hey, thanks for that. I kind of this like the semi-automatic rifle, to be honest. Sure. Because, like, Ladies through the first game, and what we've been using for this one is a in bolt action. I'm not supposed to say anything. 
But Joel's worried about you. There's... There's nothing to worry about. Well, I'm sure there isn't. But if you don't talk to him, he's gonna think something's wrong. I talk to him. Well, you have to do more than mm. hi and bye. <sighs> okay, I will try. Maybe she's at a teenage stage where she just doesn't want to talk. At ease, fellas. Oh, we're going in. Wait, the door is wide open right here. Oh. We'll go. Wait. Oh. That was y'all shooting up there, right? Oh, just some stragglers. Ellie got to try out my scope. Isn't this the place where Joel Sorry. died? Yeah, feels good. Oh. I see you've, uh... You haven't gotten around to changing the string yet. I didn't know I was supposed to. <laughs> yeah, you'll, uh... We'll get you some new ones. <clears throat> well, there's that music store down there. I bet they got guitar stuff. I mean, that area's long overdue for a sweep anyway. I can keep watch. Where you say, kiddo? Sure. <laughs> And that's our cue. <laughs> All right. Are you sure you don't want to come? Get on now. He's waiting. Well, I guess we're going to the music store. Okay. Let's go. All right. On me, kiddo. <gasps> All just to get some strings. So, you and Tommy cross anything when you was out? Just the few we saw from the ridge. You? Uh, you know, found two runners in a house. Jesse tells me you're handling your own quite well on the group patrols. He's even recommending you for paired patrols. Oh, I think you're still a bit young for it. <laughs> I'm a better shot than almost all of them. And I have more experience than most of the new recruits Look. who've... You think you're ready. He's just very defensive, isn't he? He doesn't want to okay. lose. Thanks. You just do me a he favor and lose start it. with the shorter routes for now. You know, see how you handle them. All right. Hey, you remember those uh, Savage Starlight comic books that you're into? Yeah. Tommy and I found some when we were moving through that school the other day. Did you like them? Oh, well, you know what? Not really my cup of tea, but Dr. Daniela Starr, I mean, she's pretty. She's a savage. Well, what she does to Captain Ryan in that death match. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, he definitely deserved it, but. That was a nice twist how they escaped, though. <laughs> You're funny. This looks gorgeous. Music stores up that way. We have to leave the horses here. Yeah. Sounds good. Hey, Shimmer, don't get into trouble. There's that music store. Yeah, I see it. It's never easy as it seems, though, Joel. You know we're gonna go into here. We're gonna come across some bandits, so. Boost. Stragglers. I got it. You're not a kid anymore. I like how we're kind of seeing that progression through these little flashbacks. Obviously, she's getting older and worse to. Uh, well, I don't think we can go this way. What? Where she is today. Damn. Used to be able to swim across there. Okay, so now what? Well, if you're up for it, we can try cutting through that hotel. I'm up for it. Let's go. Let's get your knife ready. We got a way of getting up. Never mind, there's a front door. Damn it. Oh, that might 
be something. You think you can fit in there? Oh, God. Well, it's worth a shot. <laughs> Careful now. Yep. I'm through. Hold on. Oh, All God. Right. Why are you giving me bottles? And alcohol. And rags. You see anything? Uh, looking. Well, hello. Howdy. <laughs> you impressed? Nope. You're just too skinny. You need to eat more. <laughs> You're welcome. Random. Alright, I guess we can do a bit of searching as well whilst we're here. I've got me bottle, Joel, don't worry. Got me bottle. I've got a first aid. Yeah, yeah, wait. This place is giving me the creeps. Tell me about it. I think I see a way through, but we got spores. Put your mask on. <sighs> Don't need a mask. To. It's just us. What if we run into someone? Okay, fine. God, imagine having to do this. this. You stop wearing that mask, kiddo, and eventually you're gonna slip up in front of someone you shouldn't. I've never slipped. You ain't told nobody new, have you? Not Jesse or Dina or... Okay, good. I hear creaking. Been in here before? Uh, we just patrolled the streets. Feeling like a bit of an oversight now. Maybe. God, oh. we've still not come across the big guys yet. The big boomer guys. The one that fire the um. Looks like it was shot a while back. When did the last patrol go through here? I'm not sure. Is it one of us? Nah. Only people went missing from Jackson and them teenagers from last year. This one's too old. I would just roam. You know? Down. The guys that throw the spores. Where you going? This way. Oh. Come here. They are on patrol. Oh. Okay. Let's take them out. Wasted so much ammo though. I pressed square instead of triangle like an idiot. More infected! Get ready! Ah! 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 
I'm just gonna let Joel shoot. And then I'm just gonna melee him. Because he gets the hits, you know? <laughs> okay, we good? Any more ammo? Because when I aim for that clicker, I think I was aiming at something behind it. I don't know. I liked how that was a little bit stealthy, though. And two of us were kind of moving, you know? I just wish I would have hit triangle instead of square, though, at the end. Yeah, no, just checking for some ammo. Shit! Shit! Joel! I didn't even see the clicker coming. To be honest, I didn't even hear it. Shit, Joe. Joel, what are you doing? Mal about more, Joel! Poor DL. Right. Just a hand! Runner! Joel, I think we did it. Jesus, that was a whole bloody kerfuffle of me just up, in up. So, what do you say we give up on those strings for today? Could have said it better myself. Woo. I think our only way out is forward now. Okay, I've only got a sh well, what two rounds? Can't you tell it's been a couple of days since I played? Jesus. Normally I do like a record a couple back to back, but. Woo! That looks like it might be something. Following you. God, I'm expecting a hand to come through the wall. Oh, I'm expecting it. I'm expecting it. Reloaded, hold! 
totally forgot about them. I knew, I knew it was way too quiet when we're going through there, and it was way too long, and it was way too suspenseful, you know? I knew something was going to happen there. Doors, walls down and everything. I was dead. I actually thought I was dead. Yeah, let's let's forget the strings. It was too close. Sure. But we fucking did it. <laughs> Jesus. You good? Uh, you know, than being really old. Ain't nothing solid, not a sleep on shake off. I want to get out of here. Didn't help. We had a couple of runners in there as well. And the thing is, is uh, I thought I was actually using a shotgun. Nope, I'm using a bloody rifle. All right, where are we going, Joel? Going this way. What are you doing? Woo! What if there's like two bloaters back there? It'll be fine. Spores are clear. Oh. Quite the fight back there, huh? Not often we get a bloater around these parts. I'm honestly surprised Joel through all of this has not got Just a single scratch on him. Lose their shit when they hear about this. Let's deal with them too anyway. A date, right? Uh, on and off. Why? I hear the way Jesse talks about you. No, Jesse and I are just friends. No, no, no. I've got a pretty keen eye for these sort of things. No, you don't. Not so keen with this one. We'll see. <laughs> Don't hold your breath. Yeah. He doesn't like the penis, Joel. She's more into Dina than Jesse. So keen eye there, brother. You think you can squeeze through there? See what it is? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> oh. This is definitely someone from Jackson. <laughs> oh, shit. Jesus. Thanks. Hey, Joel. Huh? I think it's them. Think it's them? A couple that ran away last year. Was it the bag? I think you're 
Right. Jackson is a wonderful place, but we got tired of hearing the stories of people suffering everywhere else. We wanted to save lives. We had good intentions. We didn't make it an hour before running into a horde. Now we're bitten. We've decided we're gonna end our lives instead of turning. Jesus. Please tell our family and friends that we're sorry. Love Adam and Sydney. She on the way to go out, though. I shot her. I can't take my own life. I'm a fucking coward. Adam. Jesus. Only they were immune, right? <clears throat> well, let's... Let's go get Tommy and we can get these bodies back to Jackson. After you took me out of the Firefly Hospital, you said there were dozens of people like me. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's what they told me. I've never met another immune person before. Have you? I could be hiding it. You do. Do you believe that? Is now really the time for this? We traveled across the entire country to bring me to the Fireflies. I had so many questions for them. Why did you pull me out of there while I was still unconscious? Because I let them run their tests. And when I saw that they were useless, I got us out of there. How do you know they were useless? Maybe if you, you just uh, would have given them more time, they could have figured uh, something out. There was no cure. There's nothing that could help these people or anybody else. I know you wish things were different. I wish things were different. But they ain't. And we need to get these kids back to their families. Is there something else you'd like to rehash? Come on. Well, we knew what kind of why she was kind of upset and everything, but you know, it's kind of coming to light now why there's a bit of a disconnect between them. Jesse's passed out. Hey, let me do that. He's a good guy. Mm -hmm. Why didn't you tell him? Because it's his. Wasn't the right time. There you go. What about this? Anything worthwhile? Uh, actually, yeah. Abby? Uh, no. This girl, Nora, her unit was assigned to this hospital. They were collecting supplies or something. This hospital? Yeah. What, you're gonna go now? Yeah, we have a lead. 
At least just wait for Jesse to rest up. She could be gone by then. Ellie. We know her location. Maybe Tommy does too. What? Nothing. Good. Can you come help me with the door, please? Yeah. Time to head to the hospital. Right. If I follow Route 5, that should take me to the hospital. Yep. Indeed. But I feel like ending it there is a good good time because I don't want to go in from one little kind of story to another kind of story. I kind of like to have the each chapters has a little bit of a story in there. Um so next episode is gonna be in a probably an extremely long one, traveling towards the hospital or whatever we're gonna do. Um but I'm I'm glad we kind of find out. I'm liking these little flashbacks we're having with Joel and Tommy and kind of finding like the core of what's disconnecting them too so um thanks for watching keep smiling and check out my other content right here and i will see you in another video